Hey guys, it's JP554731 and I just got some stuff uh, from my proxy um, or my forwarding service. I used Big in Japan, but uh, as of late, they've been really crappy on communication. Like, it took them six days to uh, ship out my package. Like, I had to uh, keep, like, I messaged them three times and they didn't. Uh, contact me in those six days and I got really pissed off so if you're gonna use a forwarding service do not use big in Japan because they really suck um, I'm sorry but that's just the truth and uh, like I'm I don't know anything about their um, regular service like their proxy like buying stuff uh, and sending it to you but if you're trying to buy stuff on your own and sending to them using a forwarding address uh, don't uh, they call it forwarding tickets uh, I suggest you go somewhere else it may be cheap uh, but it's really not worth it okay so here's the first thing I, I got uh, three sets of system weapons uh, 006 and this consists of uh, uh, two bazookas and some Sturm Frost in the 1 to 100 scale. I'm probably not gonna use the um, bazooka or the Sturm Frost, so I'll probably sell those. Um, all I bought this for was for the weapon stand, and they actually work really well uh, for 1 to 100 figures. I'll probably put a link on uh, my review showing you which. Uh, 1 to 100 uh, scale master grade um, weapons they work well for and so um, okay so the second thing that I got was the um, masterpiece of huge arms this is the uh, Zeta Gundam version there's different versions um, this looks pretty cool it has it came with the outer casing so pretty good um, I don't remember how much I paid for this though uh, so maybe I'll uh, put um, annotation um, these are all used books by the way and they're looking pretty good um, here's the second magazine that I got Actually, I paid like 5,000 yen for EMS. It's probably because these magazines are really heavy. They're like uh, close to one kilogram each, so about 2.2 pounds. And here's the next thing I got. It actually says the price on it. I paid 1,253 yen, which is not really that bad, because um, considering that this book goes for like 2,500 yen, I'll probably do a uh, review on it so yeah it retails for 2400 yen so I got it off for half price and the shipping was only uh, 500 yen to, the, to my forwarding service big in Japan by the way sucks okay so here's my um, next magazine this is the, uh, the same thing again it's uh, the same line, it's um, Rollout Masterpiece, and this time it's the um, Double Zeta version. Let's go ahead and open this up. I actually packed this pretty well. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's the the people who shipped it to me, or to the forwarding address. This one I bought for 1,136 yen, and shipping was most likely 200 yen to 500 yen. Uh, but anyways, it looks pretty good too. Um, it looks like it has the slip cover as well and it's looking fantastic. Uh, this one retails for 1200 yen as well, so pretty good. So yeah, if you're going to buy used books, uh, Japanese books, you can buy them off uh, Amazon.co.jp, especially um, like the MOOCs or like magazine book thingies uh, related to Gundam. 
uh, I find that Amazon.co.jp is the best place to buy used. Uh, and um, there's actually, you can actually buy it off of Mandarake as well. I really love their DHL service. It's, a, um, it's really cheap and it only takes one day. Usually uh, um, I ship around uh, 8 books, 8 to 10 books. And then the shipping is like express mail and it's 2,000 yen I, I believe. And like I mentioned, it's only, it only takes one day um, from Japan to the U.S. and um, I really like the DHL service because you can uh, instead of uh, using EMS or USPS or the U.S. Postal Service, um, you don't have to leave, or actually you don't have to sign for a slip and be physically there. You can actually leave a a note on your door telling DHL, yeah, you can leave my pack as it package in your signature, which is pretty cool. And there was one more thing that I really liked about DHL. Oh, and um, usually if you uh, ship EMS or um, uh, Pri Priority Express, like it takes three to five days. It's like some of my packages end up in customs hell. Like it takes one day for uh, the, the package to get out of customs and also um, yeah it doesn't take as long like uh, and uh, I'm forgetting something uh, it's actually I, I mentioned this before but it's substantially um, less expensive for like heavier packages because uh, then like if I had shipped this um, or I actually did ship this EMS, so uh, I paid 5,000 yen, like I said, and that's bo the bulk of my order was the magazines, and um, so that's about three kilograms right there, two to three kilograms, and if I had shipped it uh, DHL, it would probably have been a flat rate of 2,400 yen, and like. Uh, Instead of three magazines, I could have shipped like ten for that price. So again, DHL, Mandarake, highly recommended. So uh, thanks again for watching. Please rate, subscribe, and comment as I always appreciate that. Uh, thanks for watching. And JP554731 signing out. See you guys later.